With a name like Blood Axe, I'm not sure how well this guy would have fared in today's social media world. I think the cancer culture would have got to him. There's more about the legendary warriors coming up next. So this is a series that has been produced by Pinehurst Coins. They're out of the U.S., a large distributor. They do a lot of stuff with um, certified coins and things like that. They they have a website, obviously, that you could check. Um, But they are creating, or they have created, a series entitled Legendary Warriors. So really neat three nines fine series of silver rounds coming out. They've released two. And uh, like I said, we're going to talk about the first two. And this is Eric Bloodaxe, the first in the series. And uh, let's get into it a little bit more. Okay, so I admit it, I'm a huge fan of warrior-themed coins and rounds. So this is right on point for what, what you should see on the channel here. And from a lot of the stuff that's in my stack. Uh, but this is just a continuation. And who doesn't love a good ass kicker? And this guy, this guy you'd want in your corner... If you were going into a dark alley with a bunch of bad dudes. Um, now, do you want him running the show for you? I don't know about that. And he was doing a lot of that back back in the day in the 10th century. He was a king, obviously, a warrior king, a uh, Viking warrior. And he was a uh, king in, in parts of Scandinavia and also in England. So really interesting dude, this uh, Eric Bloodaxe. And I think they've done a really good presentation of him for this coin like really good detail i'll just take a a quick look in here but excellent detail on the coin uh even the background for a round i mean it's just a bullion round come on that's pretty good i mean maybe my camera works not but the coin itself is uh is pretty fantastic looking so the series is there's not a lot to be known right now about the series so i'm i'm digging there's a bunch more coming there's like the genghis khans and the alexander the greats and a whole bunch of others and it, you know i'll just keep the video going here with with another look at the the second release which would be julius caesar now this guy julius caesar is uh, obviously probably a little more well known by the community here but um you know roman emperor conqueror considered a great warrior in history a literary uh, contributor to history, a senator and a politician. This guy had it all. So I guess he does fit the bill of legendary warrior. He also he also bit the bullet at the hand of the sword. So live by the sword, die by the sword. Julius Caesar, really good representation here. Again, I would say the blood ox to me is better, but I'll just dive in a little bit closer here on, on the Caesar. But yeah, pretty good detail for rounds. You know, you can't complain. I, I'm not complaining for sure. And I look, again, forward to more in the series. But that's the first two rounds. From a spec perspective, we're looking at nine, 39 millimeters. And uh, read it edge, 39 millimeters diameter. So, you know, there's, there's really little detail on these coins, if I'm honest. So I just wanted to highlight the, the features and the look. Sort of talk about the series. Again, there's a whole number of coins uh, that are said to be released, you know, as, as upwards of 10 to 12 different coins coming. So interesting uh, series to look at. It's not going to break your bank looking at this silver. And um, who doesn't love, like I said earlier in the video, a good ass kicker. And Eric Bloodaxe and Mr. Julius Caesar, two good characters in history to start with. So I look forward to more. And I hope you guys look forward to more. And please join the channel. Check out some of the videos that are available here up on the screen. And stick with us. Take care.